Hello friends, this video on mathematical reasoning part 4 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 3. Discuss exclusive and inclusive. In case of exclusive or, we talk about only one of the two. For example, I'll say that I have, let's suppose, 5 lakh rupees and I have two, I have two options. I can buy Indica car or uh, let's suppose Indica car or, Mar or let's suppose car A and car B. Car A and car B. Both car cost is 5 lakh rupees. So in 5 lakh rupees, I can buy only one car. So I can say that in 5 lakhs, I can buy car A or car B. Correct? So since I have only 5 lakh rupees and both the car cost is 5 lakh rupees each, so I can buy only one car. So it's only one of this. So this is exclusive statement. If I buy car A, I won't buy car B. If I buy car B, I won't buy car B. In case of including statement, both or one. Both or one or two. For example, let's suppose if I have 10 lakh rupees. So I'll say in 10 lakhs, in 10 lakhs, I can buy this I. I can buy B B Y. So the spelling is wrong here. Buy car A or car B. That means if I like car A, I'll buy car B. If I like car B, I'll buy car B. And if I like both car, I can buy both car, car A and car B because I have 10 lakh rupees and one car costs 5 lakh rupees. So including statement is a statement where both or one of the two is true. In exclusive statement, only one is true. So we'll take for example. For example, when you go for a buffet, then an ice cream or gulab jamun is available with a thali in the restaurant. So if you go to a restaurant for a buffet, either they'll give you gulab jamun or they'll give you ice cream. So either of these, because in buffet you have limited options. So here, only one is possible. So this is exclusive. But we'll take one example. A student who has taken physics or maths can apply for physics. So here both of them can also apply. Person who has taken physics can apply, person who has taken maths can apply, and person who has taken both physics and maths, they can also apply. Correct? So this is an example of inclusive statement. So you got the point, in exclusive statement, it is exclusive. Exclusively only for one. That means you can either take ice cream or you can give, take gulab jamun, or you can buy car A or car. In case of inclusive, you can take both or one. Then you can see, for example, person who has physics can apply, person who has maths can apply, person who has both physics and maths can apply. Similarly, if you have 10 lakhs, you can buy car A, you can buy car B, or you can buy both car and car. We'll take some examples here to find exclusive or inclusive. To enter a country, you need passport or the voter card. So if you see, you can enter the country with passport, you can enter the country with voter card. If you have both passport and voter card, then also you can enter. Correct? So that means this is both A or B or A or B. For example, you can enter with passport, you can enter with voter card, or you can enter both with passport. So this is exclusive. Not exclusive, this is inclusive. In exclusive, you have exclusive, only one is allowed. The school is closed if it is holiday or Sunday. If it is a holiday, for example, Independence Day, it is closed. If it is Sunday, it is closed. Also, there can be a day where holiday is on Sunday. For example, when you have Independence Day on Sunday, the school is closed. So, school is closed both on holiday or Sunday. So, it is also inclusive. Two lines intersect at a point or are a parallel. So, if there are two lines, for example, this line, they are intersecting or they are parallel. So, at the given point of time, only one can be possible. They can either intersect or they can be parallel. Both can't happen in one go. So this is an example of exclusive. Because you can't have two lines both where both are parallel and they are intersecting. That is not possible. Student can take French or Sanskrit as their third language. Here also student can take either French or Sanskrit. They can't take both languages as their third language because they have to study only one language. Student can take French or Sanskrit as their third language. Here also if you see, they can take either French or Sanskrit. They can't take both languages because they can study only one language. Correct? So this is also example of exclusivity. Or we'll take one more example. 
For example, I can say that I can get admitted to school A or school B for class 10, for example. So here if you see, I can't take admission in two schools. It's legally incorrect. I can take admission only in one school, in school A or school B. So this is also an example of exclusive statement because I can take admission in only, only one school, either school A or school B. I can't take admission in both the schools. But the similar statement you can say, I can study in, let's suppose, uh, their coaching center, right? Coaching center 1, coaching A or coaching B. So here if you see this is a enclosing statement because at the given point of time you can study in both the coaching. For example, coaching A is for science and coaching B is for math. So you can attend both the coaching center or you can attend only one depending on your mood. So this is an example of inclusive statement. So don't just go by the word for inclusive and exclusive. You have to understand the statement correctly. Try to get the meaning of the statement and then only you can make out whether it is inclusive or exclusive. Example, when I told I want to, I can buy car A or car B. So in the first case, when I had only 5 lakh rupees and the cost of each car is 5 lakh rupees, that was an exclusive statement because I can buy only one car with 5 lakh rupees. But the moment I had 10 lakh rupees, I can buy two cars. I can buy car A or car B or car A and B both. So you have to understand the meaning of the statement, the context of the statement, then only you can tell whether the statement is exclusive or Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.